Hello everyone, I'm Marcus Gunn. I'm Senior Vice President for Chubb Group and Regional President for Chubb in Latin America. At Chubb, we take pride of being part of a diverse global workforce where everyone is encouraged to contribute very, their very best and where we believe that culture and inclusion really matters. I invite you all to join us in celebrating the Hispanic Heritage Month in the United States which goes from September 15th till October 15th, and it honors the contribution of fellow Americans with ancestors ori originating from Spain, Mexico, Caribbean, Central America, and South America, and who have contributed to the vibrant development, history, culture of growth, and expansion of the United States. I was born in Buenos Aires, Argentina, and therefore have a Hispanic ancestry. So, and I would like to share with you that I come from an insurance family. My grandfather, my uncle, my father, they all worked in the insurance industry. They formed a broker in Argentina for whom I worked for about six years. But then I wanted to learn underwriting. And at the time, Chubb Argentina was being formed. So I joined Chubb uh, and, uh, as an underwriter, as a junior underwriter, where it was the fir my first steps in the insurance world. Having said that, um, three years later, there was a big career opportunity in ACE to become their PNC manager, which I was able to, to get the job and work for the company for, in Argentina for three years. After that, there was an open position as CEO in Chile with ACE, which uh, I got offered and accepted. So it was a great, it was a great I would say, career move. Um, number one, because it was my first move outside of Argentina. I started, so I, I was becoming, let's say, an international executive. And the challenge was to, to really reshape the operation, which fortunately we were able to do with all the team locally and obviously with all the support of the region and the globe. Um, after that, um, I was able to, I was offered to become the regional vice president of accident and health. So that got me into, I would say, another realm in the sense that it was a line of business which I wasn't really familiar with. And also, started, I started as an executive, as a regional executive, starting to understand the, what does it mean to run different countries with different cultures and obviously within the bank assurance and affinity model. Um, two years later, um, there, was a, there, was a, there was a restructure within the region um, who was running Accident and Health for Asia Pac comes back to Latin America to run the region. And, there, and, and at that time, I was offered to go to Singapore, which I spent about three years as the regional vice president of Accident and Health, which was another amazing, I would say, move for me because it, it allowed me again to learn about cultures in Asia Pac, the different countries, the different business models, and obviously widening, let's say, my, my management skills. Um, after that, I was offered to come back to the region, to Latin America, based out of Santiago, where we had our regional office reporting to the CEO, and I was the COO for the region. So I had responsibilities over certain countries and certain lines of business, and also operations and IT. So that was, I would say, a great experience, and prepared me to what came after, which was in Mexico in 2013, we acquired uh, the fifth largest auto company in Mexico, and uh, the largest surety company, plus well, the operation that we had at NACE at the time. So it was a, an integration of three companies all right off the bat. Um, two years later, we bought Chubb, or we had the Chubb uh, merge acquisition, which added another, let's say, two companies to the operation in Mexico. So we were running with five licenses, three insurance companies, two surety companies. And the, the task there was to obviously glue everything together and obviously generate and, and, and have just one single Chubb culture in, in Mexico, which I think went really well. And when we look at the numbers of how Mexico has progressed over the last four years, I think it's, it's been a, an amazing ride, an amazing way to learn, not only the business, but really how to operate and integrate different cultures. And from the last four weeks, um, I was offered to become the president of Latin America, so I'll be moving from Mexico City to Miami uh, in January. I'm waiting for my sons to finish the first term and therefore make that move um, a little bit easier for them. And in the meantime, obviously, my challenge and my focus 
is really going back to the region and being able to visit each one of the countries and really understanding the dynamics, the opportunities, and obviously pre preparing a, a very solid plan for, two and for 2020. So I'm in front of, I would say, great opportunities. We have an amazing team in Latin America with a great cultural diversity. And I think we, we, the challenge right now is how do we get bigger, better, faster, and more agile, and to continue our leadership within the region. I really want to thank you all for your attention and encourage you to learn more about the Hispanic Heritage, Heritage Month. And I just want to take the opportunity to really um, stress um, the idea that within Chubb, diversity is, I would say, it's paramount. And I think when we look at the way we operate, both in, in every single region, every single office, um, I couldn't be more proud of who we are and how we operate and how we, we really feel as part of one single family. So make the most out of it. I think there's nothing nicer to do what one loves and more importantly, to do it with one, with the people that you really like doing it with. And I think at Chubb we have those, those combinations. We have passionate people, passionate executives, and an amazing team to share it with. So having said that, again, thank you very much, and hope to see you soon. Bye.